So yesterday we had the opportunity to go to Battle River Brewing in Tom's River. And uh, this is what we saw when we walked in. What a great view, great place, nice and clean. And now to look at the beer menu and decide what we're gonna drink. So many choices. So here it was, a chai tea party and a King St. Kolsch. Hey guys, so we, we're doing a brew review over at Battle, Battle River Brewing. I got the Kolsch, um, poured off nice. Mmm, extremely good. Very good Kolsch. My buddy got uh, some chai brew. Um, we're right out, right out on the street, and uh, they got a festival going now. So uh, I'll see if I can show you that. Pretty crowded. It's the Comfort Food Festival. We got another bar tap over there in the middle of the street that's pretty close. And uh, should be an inter interesting day. But uh, let's go back to this coast. Nice and clear. Had basically a little head on it. Got a lot of spiciness in it. Cleans up nice. I can smell someone's barbecue and stuff. Um, I think what we're gonna do with this beer though is we're gonna rate it and we're gonna move on for now. Um, good beer. I'm gonna rate it in at 7.8. It's a solid beer. It's a solid cold. I would definitely get it again. It's pretty crowded. But We'll catch up to you guys. I'm sure we'll have more later on. So the, the brewery basically consists of a seven barrel brew house with seven seven barrel fermenters uh, that they have in the basement. Um, they also have some bright tanks there as well. Hey guys, so we're working on our next beer review over here at uh, Battle River Brewing. Uh, this one's called Mariner Pilsner. It is a Pilsner that comes in at 5.5%. I watched it pour it, it's nice and clear, really light. That is Pilsen malt, 100%, maybe a little bit of weed in there, but I don't think so because it didn't head retain anything. Um, got a big old crowd going down on the street. Looks like it's good old time. We're gonna hit some food in a little bit. But I wanted to get this Pilsner out because we've been working on Pilsners lately. So, uh, basically, no aroma, and I just spilled some, so that's a waste of some beer, but we'll see how it tastes. Not bad, not bad, not quite totally German but definitely spicy. Got a back end spice that uh, I've never really tasted before. So it must just be the strain of hop and, and the year, you know, that it's grown. But it's, it's definitely a good German beer. Here comes my partner in crime. He's got two fists of drinking over there. But yeah, good beer. I seen some uh, hamburgers that look pretty awesome. That is one loud ass dog. But uh, yeah, so that's a review guys. This place is jamming right now. I'm sure you come down here when the festival isn't going on, you have a good old time.
We might get one more in there. Do another review. So yeah, these are the food trucks. Got the vendors. We're doing our third review, and I'm sorry I can't show my face really because I'm limited on space here. But this is my Rio Rio uh, brew, which is a Mexican style something. Uh, I'll get the specifics on it. But it's poured. We got a full full thing going on there. I got no head left on it. Um. Nothing really going on in inside of it. I know you have to ask him. He's got the, he's a techie guy here. Um, wow. That is nice. That is nice. Um. He's starting, he's got his own YouTube channel going on with the origin. Looks like what he's going to do. No, it's a pocket too. The two? Yep. Okay, very good. So, yeah, this is our beer. Um, pretty balanced. Um, good mouthfeel. Not too many hops in it. I forget what the IBUs are. I wish I had an IBU chart thing on it, but. Definitely good beer. I haven't had a bad beer here yet. Not that I'm wishing upon it, but I just talked to the owners. They are wonderful. They're like, come on down, do a podcast from here, blah, blah, blah. Um, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, this beer, I'm going to get the name of it before I leave here. And, uh, you know, it's your average type beer. It's nothing, nothing really fancy dancy. Um, would I get it again? No doubt about it. Is it something that I'd be like, dude, you gotta try this? No, it's not that. We haven't ran across that yet here. Um, those are few and far behind, between rather. But uh, just wanna come in, in at like, I don't know, 7.7? Seven, seven? Good solid beer. Solid beers I've had here. And I've been staying to the low side. Five, six percent. Well, you did try one stone uh, quad. I did taste my buddy's quad. He, he got a quad. I just took a sip of that. That that. Oh man, that was really good. But that thing will hurt you. You're you're not yeah, drinking well, that can't drink a lot that of night. Thing. You got to moderate. Yep. I only had one. Yep. I only had one sip. But uh, yeah, so that's a review from over here at Battle River Brewing. Um, great place. Great feel. Brew stuff is right inside the place. Nice downtown atmosphere. crazy. So every month they have a festival, whether it's food festival, you know, Italian festival, something like that. And every weekend they shut down the street outside and they have at least food trucks. And uh, they have bands out there and stuff like that. Definitely great. What a great spot. Battle River Brewing.